You got fired from your first band? That's a funny story. What, the, uh, what, what are those boys doing now? What are they thinking? <laughs> you know, it it was uh, it was that it wasn't actually Grambling Country. That was the band that then I eventually we we formed in in the military. The other band it had uh, it had a girl singer in it and a steel guitar player, a couple of guitar players, me and. Uh, and I and I don't know why, but this guy that started the band just thought. He said, "You know, we just don't think you're country enough. And you just don't sound real country to us, so we're gonna let you go." I said, "I'm well, that's, that's weird. <laughs> I think I'm only country." <laughs> but anyway, so that that's true. That's a true story, and so. So it worked out better for me. I was able to find some other guys and play, you know, story in the military. For, yeah. And we played as Ramblin' Country there for, for a good while. And then once I got out, we, uh, I stuck around there for about six more months. Went to the University of Hawaii for a semester and still played music. And then I just got a Highland fever so bad I had to come home. Yeah. I wonder well, if those guys service. ever say, oh man, what were we thinking? We Fire George Strait. That's like, that was dumb. Yeah. I don't think that would have gone very far anyway. <laughs> <laughs>